let's start with introductions. Uh, tell me your name, first and last, where you currently live, and what do you do? My name is Michael Azara. I uh, currently live in Hermosa Beach, California, which is a little beach community in Los Angeles. And uh, I work in finance. I uh, work as a, uh, like a mortgage banker. Very cool. Very cool. So tell me about Michigan State. How, how, did, how did you become a Michigan State fan? So for one, I am a Spartan. See, I bleed red because I'm human, and I bleed green because I'm a Spartan. Those are two things that go to the death with me. Um, I'm a big fan just because uh, I came from a very small, poor town in Michigan, and the first to graduate college in my entire family, and uh, made it through on my own, and not only made it through, made it to every tailgate. I made it to every, the final four, to the Rose Bowl. Shall I continue? I can go forever. So I'm a Spartan. Um, well, tell me a little bit about um, Michigan State. What, what does it mean to be a Michigan State fan? Loyalty, brotherhood. I don't care where I go in a country. I've been to Rome, Italy before, and somehow I'll find a bar that will A, have a Michigan State game if it's on, and B, find somebody that knows Michigan State. There's a Michigan State bar two blocks from my house in Hermosa Beach, California. It's called Sharky's. So it's a brotherhood. doesn't matter where you're at. You might live quite a ways away from your family, but you always have your Spartan family. You're always home. That's great. I'm always home. <laughs> Tell me a little bit about um, what it, it, for someone who's never been to um, Lansing, uh, tell me what it's like to game day. What's what's game day like? Adrenaline. It, 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 it's hard to explain. You wake up with goosebumps. I mean, you're waking up at 4 a.m. even if you went to bed at 2 a.m. like you had a full night of sleep because you're just excited like a little kid on Christmas. Everybody comes together. You know, grandparents, parents, third generation, first generation, even little kids that are uh, excited to go to Michigan State, and it's all a big family there for one great cause, which is to have a Spartan victory and just, uh, you know, yell green or white. So it's, it's, it's like a big family. It really is. Green or white all day. What, when you're in the stadium and the game's going, and describe some of those traditions that happen. Describe some of those things that happen like every game that like, kind of get your blood pumping that gets the crowd going. Biggest thing is Sparty. I mean, we got the coolest mascot in all of football. Think about it. You got horses, you got little bears, you got these silly things. We have a big, buff, cool, angry looking guy that has bigger muscles than anybody. I mean, you can't have anything better than that. Think about it. I mean, Spartan just bleeds like bravado, it bleeds champion, it breeds like, like the top. I mean, you've seen 300, right? It's a movie that just talks about dominance. Well, gee, who, who's the one that, that plays a clip on, their, uh, on, on the scoreboard? Um, uh, right before the game. That would be us. That's not the other guy down the street in, uh, in, in Ann Arbor. <laughs> Where? I've never heard of it. Um, tell me a little bit about, like, so what, like, what's your favorite memory when it comes to Michigan State football? I got two. Number one is the Michigan-Michigan State game in Ann Arbor, which was in 2005, where we, I think it's 2005 or 2006, where we reached triple overtime. It was in the big house. It was my first time to the big house. That's where our rival Michigan plays. We lost the game, but it was so intense, somehow getting into 100,000 plus people in the student section, dressed green and white to a T, with the biggest winning team in football, which is those other little, the little brothers on the street in Michigan. That's number one, but I gotta say it just got topped a few months back. Pasadena, California, Rose Bowl, my first full year here. They shut down Pasadena. They shut down LA Live by the Staples Center. But I mean shut down, they had a pep rally of over 25,000 people in Los Angeles. You couldn't get off the exit. And to see us win, I was on the field by the way, I'll, I'll show you some pictures on that. To see us win this game, it just started my year out so this is going to be a great year. Because you know what, this is start your year out like that in your new town. It made me feel right back at home, back in Michigan, living in LA. Nice, very cool. Um, excellent. Uh, tell me your name one more time please. My name is Michael Azara. And I live in Los Angeles uh, in a beach community called Hermosa Beach. Hermosa, great. Um, let's take a stab at the lines. Perfect. Um, so I want these to be read. Pretty excited. I'm, your energy is really good. I want, you to, I want you to be kind of right where you are with that interview. Um, maybe even up just a little bit. Uh, confidence, bordering on cockiness. Um, really just want you to kind of, uh, kind of get us excited about it. Okay? Sounds like a plan. Don't rush through it. I want to be excited, but don't rush through it, okay? Yep. When I say go for it, we'll give it a run. Go for it. We have the best fans in the game. Nobody goes harder than us. We're Spartans. Hard to imagine we won't be in. All we really have to do is beat Michigan. Michigan? 
Michigan? Really? Seriously? Why can't be we? Why can't we be the ones at the end? We got just as good of a shot as anybody. So yeah, you know what? We'll be in. I know we'll be in. That's a promise. That's just not me talking. No doubt. I'm in. Tell me your name one more time. Michael Lazara. Good. I want you to do it one more time. You got it. I want you to keep the same pace through the whole thing. Energy was good. Just kind of keep the same pace. Don't add anything to the lines. Okay. Only because for this commercial, you're going to be saying these lines with 128 different people from different schools. Okay. The second line, you're going to be saying with 64 people from 64 schools. The next line, 32, then 16, 8, 4, 2, until just one person saying the last one. So there has to be this like, you know, steady pace to it. Um, you got it. You have to stick to the script, okay? So give it a shot. Um, when I sit there, go over, we'll give it again, okay? Go for it. We have the best fans in the game. Nobody goes harder than us. Hard to imagine we won't be in. All we really have to do is beat Michigan. Seriously? Why can't, you, why, can't, why can't we be the ones in the end? We've got just as good of a shot than anybody. So yeah, we will be in. No doubt. I'm in. Tell me your name one more time. Michael Lazara. That was, that was perfect. That was my favorite ending so far. You're the first one to like lean in and make me believe it. I really appreciate that. So um, Champions, baby. Should, exactly. We, um, uh, news should come very, very soon. So um, hang tight. I'll get that to you as soon as possible, okay? As far as news, like as far as filming, we'll know tonight, right? I would, uh, filming is Thursday or Friday. That's what I'm trying to find out so I can plan a court. Now I'll make it happen. I just got to know a little bit of a few hours in advance. I would imagine that you'll film Friday. I just can't confirm that yet. So okay. Hang tight. We'll get that to you, okay? You are awesome. Appreciate your time. Thanks, and, uh, Appreciate you. We'll go green. Go green. Bye-bye. Take care. Bye-bye.